In the past clips, we focused on the differential to measure changes in function value along a tangent line, a line tangent to the graph of a function. So here's the picture. Suppose we have a differentiable function, a function is differentiable in A, and uh, look at the tangent line through A, F, A. Yeah, so we have the graph of F, and in yellow we have the tangent line in A, F, A. Then this line, L, has the following equation. The equation of L is given by y equals f a plus f prime a times x minus a. Basically this shows that we obtain the line L as a graph of a linear function. And uh, this linear function is called the linear approximation of f in a. Yeah, this is a graph of a linear function. Look on the right hand side of the equation defining L. There is a number a, which plays a role, and a variable x, but in a linear fashion. So the linear function LFA in x equals fa plus f prime a times x minus a is called the linear approximation of f in a. Yeah, so L is the graph, yeah, the line L is the graph of the linear approximation of f in a. Okay, an example. So suppose we take a function of x equals the square root of x and consider point a is 4. Then the linear approximation of f in 4 equals f4 plus f prime 4 times x minus 4. Yeah, just take a derivative of the square root of x. We find 1 over 2 times the square root of x, so we obtain the following as the linear approximation is 2 plus 1 over 4 times x minus 4 equals 1 plus 1 over 4 times x. Yeah, in the picture we see the following, so we have the graph of the function f and look at 4, 2, then the graph of the function LF4, the linear approximation, is the tangent line in 4, 2.